Look at this. Light with body buttercream. Hello everyone. Welcome back to Aura Permata. I'm Nastari and today I'm excited to be here with you again for the tutorial video. And today we are diving into the world of natural skincare. I'm going to show you how to make a luxurious lightweight body butter cream that won't leave your skin feeling heavy, greasy, but will provide a deep hydration and promote smoothness and elasticity. Here we have uh, three pieces of ingredient that I already weighed before, like a uh, water paste, uh, paste two will be uh, like an uh, oil paste, and paste three will be like a uh, cool down paste. Body butter cream is a fantastic way to nourish and hydrate your skin, especially in the tropical climate like in Bali, the best part, you can uh, tailorate to your preferences, ensuring the exactly what your skin needs to trip into these weathers. To make our body butter cream even more luxurious and creamy, I will be incorporating water like olive vera juice and glycerin and oil like butter and emulsifying wax together to make the body butter even more luxurious and creamy that we uh, cooperate with water and emulsifying wax. This combination helps to blend the oils and water together to create a silky smooth uh, texture and that uh, feel amazing on the skin. Plus, it adds an extra layer, the hydration, uh, leaving your skin feeling soft, supple, and moisturized uh, all day long. Now, let's talk about what goes into our lightweight body butter cream. We will be using a blend of nourishing butters like I prepare here, like uh, mango butter and shea butter. I like to combine two types these butters because it gives me like feeling soft on my skin. So. I like to use this one. A grape seed oil. This is a lightweight oil. The water here, I use a uh, olive vera juice. That's a uh, perfect for tropical condition. Ingredient like mango butter, shea butter, grape seed oils. It will uh, provide a deep hydration without feeling heavy and greasy on the skin. Plus, we will add a touch of vitamin E oils. This is to promote smooth and elasticity leaving your skin feeling soft, supple, and refreshed after the heat. And to add tropical fragrance to our body butter cream, we will be incorporating a combination of Ilang Ilang and Anjipani essential oil. This is my favorite essential oil. This oil is not only smell amazing, but also have calming and shooting properties. It's perfect for relaxing your mind and body after a long day after the sun. Once we uh, whip up our luxurious body butter cream, I will share some tips on how to use it uh, effectively and uh, incorporate to your skincare routines for maximum benefits. If you are ready to indulge your skin with uh, some homemade goodness that's uh, perfect for our tropical climates. Stick around because we are about to get started. Don't forget to like and subscribing and sharing this video to your friends who may also want to elevate their skincare games. Thank you for joining me uh, on this journey and let's dive into making some amazing lightweight body butter cream together. Okay, I will show you all the ingredients that I divide already with three pastes. One is a water paste, two is oil paste, and three is cool down paste. First, in the water paste, we have uh, olive vera juice. I have a uh, glycerin, it's a uh, vegetable glycerin. This is act like a humectant for moisturizing. We have uh, zantam gums. This will be act like a, it's natural thickening agent. On the oil paste, I have a uh, grapeseed oil. It's very light oil. It's uh, very good for the skin and also it's easy to absorb. Combination of two butters, mango butters and shea butter. 
Why? Because I like this to give me a very deep moisturize and elasticity for the skin. I have uh, two combination of emulsifying wax. One is Olive Foam 1000. This wax is made with olive oil. One is a uh, glycerin tarot. This combination will give you a smooth texture and creamier in the body butter blender. And also I add uh, acetyl alcohol. This one acts as emollient in the skincare products. And also it's a uh, thickening. So this is our oil paste. And on the cold down paste, later we will add vitamin E oil. Also, I will add a natural preservative. I use Optifin Plus. We will add a combination of Ylang Ylang and Frangipani essential oil. So let's get started. First, we will combine water paste. How to combine this water paste to become easier to dissolve the glycerin to xanthan gum? We mix, mix until all is combined. And then we will add into our water. We mix together. Look, I'm using this hot plate steering. You can use a, a double boiler too. Here I use hot steering. While we are waiting for the water to heat it up, now let's mix our oil paste we have the grapeseed oils and this is the mango butter and shea butter i will combine together in the oil and now this is the emulsifying wax olive 1000 Okay, now we hit together. We wait until all is melted. Okay, now it's all melted. After this, we will combine all water and oil together, create silky smooth texture. To wait a little bit more until all is incorporated. Now we will combine the water and the oil together now we will create magic here we will use a stick blender when it cold this cream will turn a little bit thicker now it's still liquid but when it cold this will turn more thicker than this beautiful line and we will wait until it cool down. It's 140 Fahrenheit, so it's good to add the cold down place. We need a 5 gram of the pin plus vitamin E oil. Now we add the crunchy pan essential oil. So now we combine all together. See, it's become thicker. It smells so good. Before we pour the cream into our container, I wanted to test the pH of this cream. We need a distilled water. So I use this. Water. And now we will add a little bit of cream. Mix, 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 mix until all is combined. Now I will get my pH test. So after all is complete, combined, and deep enough, like this one, 
you see smooth texture after all this combined now we will test the ph I use the pH balance bar to check my products or sometimes I use pH meter pH balance. This I use it when I make product for sale. And for now because this cream is for myself, now I will use this one. We dip into the milk and we need to check how much is this. See? is exactly 5.5. So the pH is not too high, too less. It's Perfect. Now it's done. We will transfer to the container like this one. Look at this. Lightweight body butter cream. Thank you for joining me on this journey and creativities. Please don't forget to share, like, and subscribe this video. And I'll see you next time again. Bye bye.